There's something peculiar about the number nine. So I thought I would do a recording so that I have a record of this phenomenon that I could use to prove to others that something weird is going on with the number nine. So as you can see here, I have a nine cards on the table. I'll go ahead and just gather these up. Now, if you are here, I would just have you cut the cards or we can perform a Charlier shuffle, which is what I'm doing here. Now, the weird thing is that if you perform a left-right shuffle with random stacking, uh, however you would like. So if you're here, um, I would just have you tell me how to stack these. You want right on left? Okay. Now, as far as I can tell, you can do as many of these as you like with random stacking. You can do this, well forever. I, I haven't tested it forever, but it appears to work. So maybe we'll go like that and do another Charlier shuffle. And then if I follow it up with something called the over under shuffle, this is where you go over, under, over, under, over, under, over, under. And then the Klondike shuffle, which you may have seen, this is where you take the top and bottom cards off is one. This packet just seems to continue to have strange properties, strange properties. Once again, if you're here, I'd have you cut it. Oh, have you seen a feral shuffle before? This is one that I've done and it seems to not harm anything, which is most remarkable. Now I do have more cards on the left than on the right. So I just did a feral kind of inside the other one. Uh, why don't we go ahead and just do a Charlier shuffle. And then if you like, we could even do what's called an even or odd up jog, okay? We can do one of these, or as far as I can tell, we can do a million of them, okay? And then the strange thing is, if I deal out the cards in a triangle pattern like this, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, it always turns out the same. These nine cards that are now in three piles of three always consists of cards within each pile that add to nine. Isn't that freaky? I mean, how, how could that be true after all of this? Okay, let's just check it here to see if it's still behaving as strangely as it has off camera. Okay, well, that adds up to nine. What about these here? Oh, that's nine as well. Oh, what about these three? Uh, looks like nine also. <laughs> I sure hope one or more of the viewers can explain to me what the heck is going on with the number nine. It just seems to defy all the known laws of modern physics. So check this out for yourself. Start with that original kind of spooky ordering to these cards. Go through all of the steps that I mentioned, including as many shuffles as you like of the different ones that I repeated. And then finish with this triangle deal and see if you also confirm that indeed the number nine is very peculiar. So thank you for watching and take a look at other videos on the Absolute Math Magic channel.